Family mourning the loss of their 19-year-old son tonight after he was killed during a bull riding accident. Tonight, they're sharing how he inspired them to live life to the fullest. New specialist Debbie Worthen is live in Provo right now. Debbie, another tragedy tonight. Yeah, just so sad. The Andersons told me it was Saturday night when they got the call that their 19-year-old son, Tate, was being brought here to the hospital by life flight. Now, they say he lived to ride bulls, and if he could tell people something tonight, he would say, live your dream. He kept us on our toes. There was never a dull moment with Tate. The Andersons say Tate's love for riding bulls started when he was just three years old. He would ride the back of the couch. Anything. He, anything that he could think of, he was bull riding. Tate was planning his next rodeo Saturday night when his passion turned deadly. Roy got the call around six from one of Tate's colleagues. Told us that uh, the bull stepped on his sternum and to, to get there as fast as we can. Their son was flown to Utah Valley Hospital. I think we were only there for 40 minutes before we got the news that in surgery he didn't make it. Now, as Megan talks about him, she clutches his cross. He lived, breathed, loved. That was his language, was bull riding. For the Andersons, they will miss his zest for life, his passion for rodeo, and his enthusiasm that was contagious to everyone around. He just loved to play and he loved to, he loved to make people happy. That could, kid could have been a kid for life. Talking to them tonight, you could feel where he got all of that enthusiasm for life. They were such an incredible couple. There is a GoFundMe set up to help with medical expenses. That link will be on our website, ksltv.com. Back to you. It's going to be such a tough loss. Debbie, thank you.